the increasing population of the world, pollution of agricultural lands and water resources bring concerns about potential food problems that may be experienced in the near future. Humanity is looking for different ways to feed the increasing population and diverging to alternative resources. Consequently, sustainable use of biodiversity is gaining importance in preventing hunger and malnutrition. Biodiversity is defined as the diversity of plants, animals or other living creatures in a certain area or region and it is essential for fulfilling the needs of humanity, especially nutrition. It is seen as a substantial power and advantage by countries. Biodiversity is very rarely involved in nutrition programs in Turkey. Although it is among the most advantageous countries in terms of ecosystem, habitat and species diversity. Significant studies are being carried out in Turkey, as well as in the world, for the sustainable use of biodiversity as the main theme of global and national nutrition, food and livelihood security strategies and programs. By ensuring the conservation and sustainable use of appropriate biodiversity for food and nutrition, the Biodiversity for Nutrition and Food project is aimed at contributing to improve the prosperity of target users and food safety. The project is an activity of the Biodiversity Initiative for Nutrition and Food and is globally coordinated by Biodiversity International. It has started in 2012, planned to be completed in 2017, and is currently being carried out in Turkey, Brazil, Kenya and Sri Lanka. The project, funded by the Global Environment Facility GEF, is the implementing agency of the United Nations Environment Programme and the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization. In Turkey, the General Directorate of Agricultural Research and Policy is the national coordinator of this grand project. The Biodiversity Project for Nutrition and Food is being carried out in 10 cities in Turkey, which are intersections of three floristic regions. The Black Sea region, Kastamonu, Sinop, the Mediterranean region, Antalya, Konya, Karaman, Mersin, the Aegean region, Izmir, Balakesir, Aydin, Mula. Studies are being carried out on 43 priority species, which are edible wild species, wild mushrooms, land races, einkorn wheat, cowpea, and taro. Within the scope of the project, Preliminary surveys were conducted in villages, local markets, restaurants and supermarkets to create a database related to wild edibles and land races. Food and antioxidant analysis were also carried out in order to determine the nutritional value of the plants being studied and to ensure that they were recorded in the database. Strategies and plans for the welfare of the local community are being developed by analyzing and interpreting the data from socio-economic research to the consumption of species. Nearly forgotten traditional knowledge as well as ethnobotanical information are collected and recorded. As a result of the studies, golden thistle, foxtail lily, and einkorn wheat have been selected as the target species with a model developed for the sustainability of the species and the further studies are concentrated on these species. In order to create policies for the sustainable use of agricultural biodiversity, the existing regulations, programs, plans and strategies in the fields of nutrition, health and education are reviewed and studies are being carried out with the ministries and the sector for its integration to the related plan and program. The preparation of the policy brief is under study. In order to create awareness in our country with rich biodiversity, we organize trainings, meetings and panels, and attend festivals about edible nature plants. 
Alachata Herb Festival became an important step to raise intended awareness with high attendance rate. To enhance marketing opportunities, national and local enterprises and market chains are being coordinated in the scope of the project. Today, the interest in alternative food sources has increased. The topics of human health, nutrition and biodiversity are open to debate within the framework of the Convention on Biological Diversity, Turkey is a part of which, especially Brazil, India and Turkey with rich biodiversity have great responsibility. In this respect, project results are of great importance both nationally and globally. For school-age children, case studies are carried out in nature, in the garden and in the kitchen in order to support the healthy nutrition and active life program of Turkey. The Nutrition Friendly Schools program to promote biodiversity and to increase awareness. Promotion materials like books, guides, flyers, banners and leaflets were published under the framework of Awareness Publication, aimed at protecting biodiversity and sustainability. Also, collecting guides were created for plant collectors and foragers. The theme of the Leader Children's Agricultural Camp Project, which was carried out by the Department of Training, Extension and Publications of the Ministry of Food, Agriculture and Livestock, has been determined as wild edible plants and planned to conduct in collaboration of BFN project in 81 provinces in Turkey. The project team, who continues to work for the sake of protecting this existing wealth, will continue to work to make the project successful with the slogan Diagnose, Protect, Nourish. Undoubtedly, this project is a prominent treasure that we can leave to the next generations. If there is biodiversity, there is life.